And in Clayton County, the new school year is officially underway, but with a much different model. All 55,000 students in that district going back to school this morning virtually. And our Rebecca Schramm's live in Riverdale. Rebecca, it's not your typical first day of school. No, not at all, Karen. I am at Riverdale Middle School, and typically on the first day of school, the building would be packed with students getting settled into their new classrooms. Right now, the only cars we're seeing belong to administrators or perhaps parents picking up uh, equipment for their children's remote learning. Yeah, this is definitely an unusual start to the new school year. It's really weird. Andrea Gamble and her five-year-old daughter Emery were among those we found at the bus stop this morning on the first day of school in Clayton County. They weren't there to put their kids on the bus. The bus driver brought meals to them. This is amazing. She just got enrolled over the weekend and when I just called the school this morning they told me to come get a laptop. I didn't think she would have to get one being a kindergartner, but clearly she does. She found out her daughter's teacher will do some live sessions and that students will do their work and upload it. She's glad her older daughter, who's in middle school, is good to go. Same for her nephew, who's starting second grade. When they shut school down in March, they automatically went digital then. So they kind of know what to do at this point. But for little Emery, I don't know where to start. She feels fortunate that she works evenings so she can be there to guide her kids through the schoolwork. For the seventh grader, she's good. She don't need me. But it's, she's probably going to be helping us because we're going to have to figure it out because Google Classroom is whipping my butt right now. <laughs> A lot of people are in the same boat here in Clayton County. There's no timeline for when students might return back to the buildings, but a school district spokeswoman tells me at the nine week mark or maybe even sooner, they're going to do an assessment to see if face to face learning or perhaps a blended model might be possible. Live in Riverdale, Rebecca Schram, CBS 46 News. Rebecca, I'm with that mom. I can't imagine doing Google Classroom. Thanks. Remember to stay with CBS 46 throughout the school year as colleges and Metro Atlanta school districts begin classes either in person or virtually. We will have all the updates for you on air and on our CBS 46 streaming app.